MPD trusts a new tool in development that's already interesting to many users. This tool lets you create trusses with various geometries. Select the launch icon and use two points to specify the desired truss position. The truss can be horizontal or tilted. The plugin window is minimalistic in this version. You can set the truss profiles and see its geometry here. If you want to rotate the profile 90 degrees, you do it here. All other settings are adjusted through direct manipulation. You can change the truss geometry by dragging the control points and handles. Adjust the length, height, diagonal spacing, and more. Now, let's look at the toolbar, the context tool panel. The first field, number of bays, controls the number of truss spans or diagonal steps in half a symmetrical truss. This should be an integer, though it currently shows as a decimal. If you change the diagonal spacing with handles, you can always undo these changes by adjusting the number in the number of bays field. The next Como box changes the type of truss diagonals. Simple and straightforward. Then there are two Como boxes for managing the truss verticals. The first one controls the central and end verticals. The second one manages the other verticals, letting you enable even or odd verticals, or disable all. The next button, invert, flips the truss. This button toggles between symmetrical and asymmetrical truss. The last button swaps the start and end of the truss, useful for asymmetrical trusses. Finally, there's a Como box for switching diagonal offsets. This Como box changes the type of diagonal connections. Centrally, diagonals intersect at one point. Eccentricity, diagonals avoid collisions with each other and the verticals. You can also set additional offsets for diagonals and end verticals. Since this tool is likely to change significantly in the future, a detailed guide may not be necessary. Hope you enjoy it, and thank you.